At this point, what genre of music do you consider yourself? Oh, I'm pop hop. I'm pop hop. Yeah, I got a new I got a new genre. Gender, however you pronounce it. Genre. It's, yeah, genre. Yeah, this pop hop right here. I ain't no nigga in this what I'm doing. I I I I pop. This not rock star. This not hip hop. This, this, this pop hop, meaning you gotta be a shit popper and not a dick hopper to listen to my shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm not I I I, I touch a few bass. I I I I I, I rub about a little female here and there. I, I, I told them some real life shit. Like I said, my been shot. You don't, hey, you, you don't, I don't even got songs about that, man. These, these niggas can't wait to goddamn go do a whole meat table about getting shot, losing the eye. I don't got to, I don't got to do that. You know what I'm saying? Like I said, it's pop hop. I'm rapping about getting money, living life, pulling up with another nigga hoe because the nigga owed me some paper. You know I'm saying? I ain't even going to beef with you, little homie. You can keep the paper, but I'm going to fuck your hoe for sure. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to hit you where you're hard at. I'm going to hit you where you hurt at. I'm like, that one, that one, that one, that one I'm doing. My, my music gonna motivate a nigga to be cool. You know what I'm saying? I'm motivating a nigga to be cool. I don't want you to go out and shoot no shit up. I don't want you to be gangster. I want you to wake up, you know what I'm saying? Say your blessings, look out for your fans, look out for your team, and go out there and pop that shit let these folks know you ain't regular. You know what I'm saying? That's what I do. I ain't, I, ain't, I ain't here to be with these niggas with this rap shit, because I've been doing this shit too long. With the, they want beefing with me back then. What the fuck we beefing now for? You know what I'm saying? So let me pop it. Yeah, what it is, man. Pop hop though. That's that what I'm doing. I'm pop hopping. Like I said, this for the this for the shit powers, not the dick hoppers. You know what I'm saying? Not for you. At all. What we doing? Now, are you referred to as a rapper? Oh, it's devil. I mean, when it comes to that, like I said, it, it, it depends. It depends on what it depends on um it depends on how long you've been in Atlanta. Now if you from Atlanta. And you and, and, and you been rocking with me, of course, hell yeah. Now, if you just, if you just moved to Atlanta, probably like 2016, 17, probably when I was slowing down, I wasn't focused, I was, I was out here trying to scam me. Then, of course, you might be like, oh, you right. But like the folks that really know, and the folks who don't see me come back around, oh, yeah, I'm a big rapper, man. Come on, man. I'm living like one. Hey, I'm here in the same hole, these nigga fucking. I have, I'm having the same back roll, same white, the same jury. Shit, was matter of fact, my jewelry better than a lot of these niggas' jewelry. These niggas shit be looking cloudy. Thunderstorm. Yeah, foo foo. Any nigga buying that bitch to fake jewelry. Come on, I ain't doing that, man. I'm solid all the way around the board. Solid all the way around the boards. Ain't too many flaws around here, dog. What is your opinion of that phrase, rapper? The phrase, rapper? Yeah, what is your opinion of it? Nigga who rhyme? Ha! <laughs> nigga who rhyme? Me go shit with like, like, a nigga who rhyme. I don't, I don't really know. A nigga who rap. A nigga put words together. He cool with the words. You know what I'm saying? He can rhyme. Now, in your opinion, what makes a great rapper? See, now you're trying to get now you trying to get me to get a game away for free, which I will do, because I know how to be a great rapper. You know what I'm saying? First you start out with great rapper, man, you just gotta be you gotta be you got you got you got to be original. You got to have you got to have the drill. You got to have that motherfucking lingo. You got to, man. They got to, they got to want to, they got to, they got to want to talk like you, walk like you, or look like you. You know what I'm saying? In this new era of rap, if they're not doing them three things, which like, like, like they, they, they do, they do all six, and I only name three on me. You know what I'm saying? They, 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 they like, like, like they got me on goddamn. Whew, they got me on full time record. But you, yeah, you got to be, you got to have the drip, you got to have the lingo, you got to have the personality. Yeah, that's it. Well, if you got all those, yeah, that, that should make the music hot. You can, you, that should, yeah, like I said, it'll make the music hot. If you got all those things, nigga, pick that shit on. Nigga, pick that shit on. Nigga, know how to talk with them words. You know what I'm saying? Nigga, be looking like that shit when he step out. Oh, yeah, a little street cred with it. Oh, yeah, he gonna be, he, he the next one up. Even though you got the goddamn dig through the haters and the these faggot ass nigga, goddamn, and the nigga who just be just be hanging for no reason. I take that back. Not the not the L word. I ain't got time for none of that. That nigga who be doing the sucker shit. The suckers. You know what I'm mean? saying? Now, how long have you been in the music industry for? I've been in the music industry since 2008, dog. Like that, I would like 2008. That's when I started. And for time reference, it's September 2021 now. Yeah, that's a long time, man. In your opinion, <clears throat> from what you've seen, what you've experienced. What's the biggest mistake Atlanta rappers make? Not fucking with the real. Not fucking the real. And they be they be misled. Cause a lot of rappers be having good intentions. A lot of rappers be like like be be ready to fuck with a nigga. 
but they don't, they don't like they don't they don't be they self. They don't they don't they don't think for they self. They don't they, don't, they ain't their own boss for real for real. They don't got their own moves. So they little they little fuck nigga or, or somebody come get in their ear and block everything. You know what I'm saying? Look how they doing him. Look how they doing the big goat man. Come on man. Ain't no nigga like I said. Ain't no rapper in Atlanta man from 2008 on the independent level fucking with me dog. Everybody done has everybody done got a stamp. Everybody from Atlanta done got a stamp from somebody, man. But Young Cool's a dog. Everybody, man. I'm around these motherfucking popping nothing, stopping doing what I'm doing. I ain't asking for no handout. I ain't kissing ass. I ain't dick rhyme. Hey, man, doing what I'm doing. Any nigga know, like, I'm like that. I'm living like that. And my niggas like that. Where, like, everybody, like, everybody who I started with, from the rich kids, everybody, from everybody, dog, they had, they had, they had some type of shot. They had some type of video on TV. Some type of big rapper behind them. Some type of song on heavy rotation on the radio. Some type of something with somebody big. And I did it. And I'm still relevant. I'm still popping. Back row still loaded. Lamb truck. Like, come on, man. Just drop the EP August 6th. I'm doing better than a lot of these rap niggas. For sure. Yeah. Now, just to be fair, what was your role with the rich kids? Shit, um, the teacher. Hey, you talking about the teacher? She the teacher. She, I wasn't doing it but teaching. You were a member of the Rich Kids. No, I was not a member. We have my my we op, we we performed at the same open mic one day at Crucial through my brother in law, KT, that's T I homie. Rich Kids performed there. They had the hot little song. They had a song with Whistle. They matter of fact, they they were they, they, they were moving way more than me. This was my first time ever performing. They had West Up, them boy had motion. I just had that true religion down, street shit, know how to pop it. So it got done, it just, it just went. They put it together. They tried to get me to be that, but I'm like, no, nah, I can't be no rich kid. I'm a little older, I'm a little sharper. But I, I get them for the game, you know what I'm saying? That's why I wanted on the cover. You know what I'm saying? I was at the chalkboard. Shit be it. And uh, when it comes to this mistake you mentioned about Atlanta rappers, right? Sure. And you said not messing with the real. I think that's what you said, or something yeah, of that nature. Real, cause it's it's a lot of real niggas out here. A lot of them got motion, got everything. A lot got everything. These rap niggas need to go to the next level, and I don't even be reaching out. I can help a lot of these niggas. A lot of these niggas stand still. A lot of these niggas falling out. A lot of these niggas ain't who they think they is. But what listen? But without the internet, and like like social media. What do you boy? Come on, man. I'm popping without social media. They done, they done, they done deleted three of my pages in in the, in the last year. Shit ain't did nothing to me. I'm still having the same motion, like the ocean. What we doing? What for the lit, small? Now, I do want to address a few things that you've just said. When it comes to the stamp, I had a chance to personally read your EPK. Okay. I saw the name Young Jeezy in there. I saw the name DJ Ace in there. Would that be fair to say that's a stamp you have or a stamp you got? No. Explain. Have you? Have, okay. How, how, how have they? How, what, what's the stamp? Oh, I don't know. I'm just saying. You said you've never no, had I the stamp. No, I, they they named me now, code. They were they, they 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 DJ Ace. That's my man. They 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 reached out to me. Um, she wanted him on music. You know what I'm saying. Pulled up to the studio, had a couple of listening sessions with the boy Snow. You know what I'm saying? He eating it up. You know what I'm saying? We, we ain't not rocking out. Got down me. He go through all my shit. He love the music. You know what I'm saying? I'll drop the EP. You know what I'm saying? It is what it is. But like, ain't nobody stunt me. You know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody stunt me, dog. I'm, I'm independent. Ain't nobody stunt me, man. You, if, if Jesus would have stunt me, you would know. Your video was, your music video was posted on his Instagram page. That's not no stunt. I ain't no stunt. I salute that. I salute the post, but I ain't no stunt. This shit bigger than the post with me. A post. Come on, man. Come on, man. What's your What's your definition of a stamp? My definition of a stamp. You, you said you've never been stamped. Some things have happened, like the post, like the reach out. But what is your that definition no of the stamp, stamp? bro? That's, that's, that that ain't no stamp. But stamp feels consistency with this shit. Hey, man. A post show. But we, we popping shit together. We on the live. We hanging. We out and about. I'm letting these folks know what's going on. Not just with me. This is just a stamp with anybody. You know what I'm saying? This is the stamp. A nigga on the high statue, a nigga on the higher statue than me, giving me all the light and, and give me all the light and shine until I got my own. Until I'm able to move by myself. That's a motherfucking stamp. These niggas ain't doing that. 
These niggas ain't guided them doing that. Yo guided Rick Ross and them. Yeah, that's a stamp. The shit where they doing 42 dub and all that, that's a stamp. Let the nigga run loose. Come on, man, I'm doing this shit. Pop or die, man. Pop or die, man. Salute, hey, salute, snow, but nah, ain't nobody stamping me. I don't, sometimes, sometimes people don't know how to stamp niggas. Sometimes people don't know how to deal with shit. Do you want to stamp? Shit, shit how, how shit looking, shit, I'm, I'm stamping myself. And, and, and this shit getting bigger. So, 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 hey, I'm building my own post always right now. I'm going to be giving out stamps, sir. Now, when it comes to this mistake of not messing with the real, have you made the same mistake yourself, or are you just going off observation here? Oh, man, I'm just going through experience. I'm the real. I ain't like, like, like I said, if any, if any real situation would have came by my way, I'd still be in it. Because I know what it really is. I know how this shit's supposed to go. I know how it's supposed to be done. A nigga don't owe me shit. A nigga don't owe me now. I'm not saying, oh, like I said, if a nigga owed me something, I'd be right here asking niggas. And, no. I can't. I, I, any situation I come to, I can't prepare. Any situation, I got 500 with me. Any situation I ever came through, any mean I ever had, I always let you know I got 500,000. What we doing? I just need to know how to do this shit the right way. I ain't got 500,000 just to, just to blow. I got 500,000 for us to make the shit bigger. What, what, like, come on, stamp me this shit. What we doing? Yeah, I ain't got 500,000 to blow. I got 500,000 for some features. Pick this shit together. What we doing? Hell, we pick this shit together like the stamp way. These niggas ain't doing that. I'm still around here wiggling. You know what I'm saying? It's, it's working, though. Like I said, they fuck with me. And I'm a genuine nigga. And I'm not, like I said, the pop undefeated. As long as you know how to pop shit, you're going to pop shit. You got to stay down. So, again, just to be fair, the post from Jeezy, the reach out, things they of that nature. That came from me, sir. Yeah, that came from DJ A. Yeah, they reached out to me. We met all that. He made a post. It's bigger than the post. That's all I'm saying, with dog. Salute the post, but I like you. We're dealing with Young Coolie. When you fuck with me and all the shit, when you fuck with me and all the shit I got and all the shit I'm doing, it's bigger than the post, dog. Since you've post been, your hoe. Uh, don't post me. Since you've been in the music industry, have there been talks or an attempt for a stamp on you? I mean, like I said, when I was just running around, when I was just running around with Snow for a minute, people were reaching out, got there. Like I said, for a couple months, I was just hearing all the type of shit with the negativity, everything. I was just blocking everything out. Even around with the Gucci, the, 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 the verses, all that shit coming to me. Folks all in my comments, and my page, but cool, but you fuck with home, home ain't. I'm blocking all that out, come like it's at the end of the day. I'm a different breed. I ain't none of these niggas he ever fuck with. I got my own bag for real. I'm, I'm popping for real. I'm, 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 I'm fucking whole. Like, 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 I'm doing everything these rap niggas doing. I, I, I'm like 92 miles from lane, man. So I don't understand when I like when I, when a nigga like me come this prepared. Why it ain't just straight green? Like, I'm coming with my own money, lounge truck, jewelry. I'm having my own security, my own motion, and I know how to rap. I know how to pop it. I'm a, I'm an entertainer. So like I said, sometimes people don't know how to stamp niggas. Sometimes people don't know how to give 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 like the other niggas. You see that yourself. Everybody ain't everybody ain't built like some of these niggas, man. Everybody ain't built like that. Everybody ain't built like Ross them. Everybody ain't doing like it's a lot of artists in fuck those situations, dog. It ain't just like. But I'm not signed though. They don't even know how my autograph looks, sir. So, so so put that out there. So don't 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 think oh young Coolie J don't want to write and sign paperwork and no. I signed a contract in the L. I swear. What is your opinion on recording contracts? What is your opinion on record deals? What is your opinion on record labels that want to sign artists? Man, I, 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 I look at this shit like this. I'm independent. And like I said, in the last, over, the last, over the last year and a half, they're going to spend almost 200000 that's that's, that's that's without That's without counting the lamb truck. That's without the jury. That's without the look, vacating. They're just straight trying to DJs, videos, paying pan people who say they can uh, fake act insulting, with consultants, all that. Yeah. Yeah, me trying to just like what they saying. Me just trying to just put money to nigga pocket so a nigga can say cool ain't never come with the free shit. Okay, cool. You, you charge this for your service, I'm going to give you this for your service. I was, so I was doing that for a whole year and a half. I'm on 200 in the hole with these folks. And with me doing that and, and, and popping my shit, I gained from it. But these folk don't be like, 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 this shit, this shit, this shit, this shit, this shit big, man. You just got to stay down and keep going. So now I have a few more questions for you. 
I, I forgot what the question was. I'm just popping. Well, don't worry. I'll take care of that. Uh, there's some new questions that have formed since uh, what you've just uh, spoke on. When it comes to this two hundred thousand dollars that you've spent on your career, have you gotten that back yet? Have you broken even? Have you profited from that yet? Off the rep. Yes. No. Yeah, no. I ain't made two hundred thousand off rep. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. But see, get what though. With me, with me. Then you gotta understand, I took a break too. So that's like, I took it like a, a year and a half break. I, I went. Then like I said, I never did. The, the way I'm doing this music shit now, I'm doing it the right way. That's why this shit costs. But doing it the right way ain't cheap. Especially when you're independent. Like, got done the rollouts and, yeah, this shit costs for sure. A dime at a time. So like, I ain't really tripping, cause like I said, I'm, I'm in it for the big picture. Sometimes you gotta spend a couple hundred dollars and get it from me. I'm with that. That's the risk I take, for sure. Especially for a nigga like me. Uh, what was the reason for the break? Uh, like I said, one, one, I was popping with the music, but I wasn't making no money off the music. I had the fans, I had the groove. I was, I was having three some three times a week with the whole. But like, like I wasn't getting booked. They, they, Atlanta, they, they, they don't want to pay you too. You scorching hot around these motherfuckers, man. So goddamn, other than that, they want to give you goddamn boofing bottles, man. Come on, man. Boofing bottles, that, 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 that's cool for for niggas start rapping last week, but goddamn. What we doing? I need some paper, dog. So like, it's popping, man. When it comes to recording contracts, record deals, record labels trying to sign recording artists, are you interested? Do you want that? If it makes sense, yes, yeah, yeah. If I sign, if I sign with you today, and my life gonna change tomorrow, yes. I can't be signing with no nigga and gotta wait for the change. No, I ain't doing that. I ain't waiting for the change. This shit gotta be. This shit gotta be instant. Have you received offers? Mm, I, don't, I don't consider them offers. Them, them, them niggas looking for them niggas looking for help. These niggas see these niggas see I got paper, so they trying to find them. no no offers. I turned on all the little pay the offers. Were the just for the record were the offers from independent record labels? Or were they from yeah, major just, record just, labels? Just, just look, people people who having money on fuck around and try to just 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 get in the way. But like I said, I'm too small for that. If the shit makes sense, and and, 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 and the shit like genuine, hey, yeah, I fuck, yeah, yeah, I sign. But as of right now, a nigga don't even know how my autograph look. Nobody. You know what I'm saying, like I said, salute DJ Ace, you know they fucking with me. But like I said, people people expecting, people expecting, like they looking at Jesus, and they looking at, but cool, all the shit you right popping, all the shit you doing, you wish no, but you supposed to be through the roof. But they, they not understand what's going on. It ain't what they thinking. It ain't like we just we just vibing, man. Home just we just fucking around. We ain't we ain't did no paperwork. We ain't did no contracts and all that. No, we we vibing. Home like my music. Home like, you know what I'm saying. I definitely can help get them back where you need to be though. You know what I'm saying. This, this, this me. I'm the big goat. Would you say the situation with you and Jeezy at this point is like a trial period? Maybe he's trying to see. Maybe he's heard the music, seen what you're about, but wants to take a closer look at you before. Maybe paperwork is offered. Maybe before recording contract and things of that nature Man, are considered. Like I said, the way the way the way I'm coming, the way I'm living, the way I'm popping, and I got one eye. Like 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 this ain't regular. The shit I'm doing, a, this, a, a nigga should want to get behind me. I'm gonna bring the bag home for everybody. I'm not doing nothing regular. Like so, I, I, I don't know what he waiting on. I ain't, like I'm not waiting on them nigga though. Oh, I, I can't wait. Like I said, I'm 13 years in my career, man. The water to my nose. I can't wait. Like, like I can't, dog. Like I said, so I appreciate the post. So everything a nigga ever attempted to do for a nigga or what we got planned, but like, it's bigger with me, dog. And I said at the end about it, dog. I, I, I ain't here for the little shenanigans. I can't. I can't. It got to be big, because I'm, I'm big. No matter what you say, man, this shit big, man. Hang with me for two, three days. You'll see. You'll see. You will see. What are your thoughts on the rap game in 2021? This is generally speaking. This is not Atlanta. This is overall. What are your thoughts on the rap game in 2021? Man, the rap game need me in 2021. They need me. I'm telling you. I'm coming with that different shit. I'm coming with that lingo. I'm coming with like I'm not, not saying nigga don't got it, but have this shit me. Have this shit, these niggas know man. This shit came from the originator, man. I, 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 I don't know how to not say it. I know he probably said, like, I'm just, he always saying that, but I don't know not how to say that, dog. I'm I, I'm watching these niggas blow with my shit, dog. 
Which is cool though. Just reach back out, fuck with a nigga. I love all the Atlanta rappers, man. We run the shit. When you say half of this is me, is there anything you want to claim that you've done? I don't even that's go, yours. I don't even want to go through the claim stage no more, man. These niggas know what's going on, man. A lot of this shit, like I said, man, just, I, I'm from Atlanta. I started with the rich kids. Only thing I go do is listen to a lot of these niggas. They stay shouting me out. We don't got to go through all that, man. Like, on the big go for real, man. Pull up young cooler, man. Come on, man. This shit, this shit, this shit ain't regular, dog. And I'm, and I'm right back on these niggas' ass. Yes, I'm right back popping. Music still hard. Like I said, man, this shit lit. You got this, like I said, that's what the rap game is, a nigga like me. And I'm bringing all my niggas in. I'm bringing all my niggas in. And, and like I said, I been staying down. I thought, I thought, I thought nigga fuck with nigga that stay down. I ain't did no sucker shit. I ain't did no, 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 no bitch shit. I ain't got caught down. I ain't like, like, I ain't did nothing, man. All my streets, all the shit I did in the streets, had that street shit. And I, it, it happened because nigga fuck with me. So, it is what it is. But I, I ain't right here just being no bully. I'm right here popping shit, dog. What annoys you the most with the music industry at this point, if anything? What annoys me the most right now is the, the difference between the, 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 the public love I get from the, the private love I get with this shit. It, 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 it's crazy. Because like I said, privately, goddamn boy, this shit up there with Drake and Wayne, got down to these nigga ass privately. But soon as they got down, nigga get out there, I'm, I'm over my shouting. I go from Drake Wayne started privately to over Mike Shawty in the public and I'll be like, man, this shit, I don't even, I don't got the end, I don't got the energy to be doing this shit with y'all nigga. I'm too real with this shit. I'ma just stay down, keep talking my shit, until I finally get in position to the point they can't deny it. That's why they can't deny it. I'm talking about overload it. My all, I'm every, and it's coming. Like, I'm it's coming, man. Go look at my old interview and look at this interview, man. I know they see the elevation, man. This shit lit, man. This shit different, man. I'm staying down for my like I said, and I ain't queen. Yeah, what we doing? Yeah, focus like no other. You know what What's the deal with that? Why are you getting private love, but that love is not out in public? What's the holdup with that? Listen, I, I, I must hit a nigga mama on the state. I don't know. What I'm trying to tell you. I don't know. I don't know. I ain't never beef with none of these rap niggas. I ain't never really beef with no DJs. Sometimes I be in that thing like, damn, cool. Maybe, 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 maybe you were popping too much when you were broke. That's what it is, but it, 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 it's, it's a confident thing, man. Yeah, it was a lot of times I ain't have a dollar. A nigga didn't know it, though. The drip was there, the, the, the cocky shit was there, and the bad bitch was right there. So they didn't know, so I don't, I don't know what it was. Maybe I was just too cocky, too confident. I don't know, dog. I, like I said, I never, I never, like, I don't know. I don't know if I ain't dick Ryan. I ain't switching sides. I can't do that. I can't do, I can't do the goofy shit. No. That why, I'm still, that why I'm still able to talk my shit, pop my shit, and, and stand on my grounds and, and say I ain't signed with nobody, and say I don't owe nobody, and say I'm the, I'm the big goat, because, hey, why, why I'm not? Why I'm not? Why I'm not? Hey, you talking about? And I took three on, lost an eye in it. So, do you know how I many the rappers would have got shot and lost an eye? Shit would have broke their spirit. They would have had 10, 20 songs about it. Nigga be running them up. No, that ain't me, dog. I reinvented myself, start throwing the shades on, cool it up, and get and get to it. My energy different, dog. I'm, I'm blessed for real, and I know that. I, I I see too many signs to even to even to even ever question God on my end. So get with it, watch me get it, man. I, I'm never stopping, dog. I'm never changing my my story about nothing. I'm like, you can ask me the next interview. I'm gonna say the same thing. Then nigga get it for me, small. I'm telling you. You mentioned God in this interview. For sure. Do you follow a religion? Um, I got baptized when I was like 12. She was like a Christian. Christianity. I don't follow. I mean, what do you mean follow it? Do you follow a religion? I pray. I, I believe in God. Yes, I, I pray heavenly. I like proud believer of God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I, I'm not right here. I haven't been to church in... I ain't been to church in about six years. Oh, I ain't good with church. I mean, they, they be capping in that motherfucker too, man. Yeah, I look at you don't hear about all the preachers be getting caught doing. Hey, man, you just gotta, you just gotta pray and believe what you believe and do what you do, man. I, 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 I can't. I just, I don't know. I'm different, dog. You know what I'm saying? I, I, I been through a lot. I seen a lot. I overcame a lot. I overcome a lot. Like so, it's like certain shit really don't get to me. Certain shit ain't gonna make me move. That's just me. Call it what you wanna call it. Just don't call me broke. 
when it comes to being baptized, raised under uh, Christianity, was that on your mom's side, father's side? No, that, was both? Mom, that was on my mom and my grandma's side, you know what I'm saying? They, my grandma was heavy into the church, you know what I'm saying? They tried to get, get me to go that way. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. God, I believe in God. It's popping in on God, the big God. Oh, my God, then. I'm saying you, you ain't notice how all, all my shit got something to do with God. All my ad lib, everything got something to do with God. Cause I really be saying what He be doing for me. You know what I'm saying? And He He still coming through. And that one thing I, I used to be around here mad, being impatient, trying to question. God damn, what going? No, listen, just stay down. Every dog get that day. Only thing you gotta do, stay alive and stay free. I promise you, stay alive and stay free. So I'm gonna shake. No, I won't be tripping. So I'm gonna shake, dog. So I'm gonna shake for real. I promise you. Now, when it comes to the music industry, for sure, on the opposite end of the spectrum, best thing mm -hmm. about the music industry, in your opinion, if any, the best thing right now about the music industry. Yeah, I asked you at first what was the most annoying thing, but now I'm asking you, what's the best thing, if any? The best thing with this music shit is if you do it the right way, this shit can change people's lives, man. That what the best thing, yeah, man. What that you talking about, man? You do this shit the right way, you get the right people behind you, you fuck around, get the right hit, you the right blessing, the right anything. This shit really can change your life, dog. And I really know that. And I know I I, I got a I got a lot. I got more I got more on the positive side of me blowing than more on the negative side of me not blowing. So I'm like, hey, but I'm keep going for sure. Hey, yeah, this motherfucker change nigga life. Man, listen, man. I'm cool with it. I'm I'm cool with the free M of the music. I ain't talking about then I made it out the streets. Now, I, they give me a free M out of music, clean on paperwork. I'm going to show y'all niggas something. Give me a clean M on paper. Then y'all go, what the hell? I know that ain't just one. Yeah. They give me one clean M on paper. Why there? Show y'all niggas something.